a start. In presenting this report, my first duty would be to thank the Dhebar Commission for preparing this valuable document. The Commission have gone deep into the various aspects of this problem and have produced an important and valuable document. The Commission had to tour a lot and they had to put in very hard work. I should like to convey my thanks and congratulations to the Chairman of the Commission, Sri Dhevar, and also to his other colleagues for this useful contribution. As the House is aware, the problem of the scheduled tribes has been constantly engaging the attention of the government since the constitution was framed and adopted. Still, the government were not satisfied with the actual progress made. It was in that context that the government appointed two committees before the Dhevar Commission was appointed. The first was the Elwin Committee, which especially dealt with the problem of the tribal blocks. The second committee was appointed on the suggestion of the Estimates Committee to study the problem of the backward committees especially. On the top of that, in pursuance of Article 339 of the Constitution, the government appointed the Dehavar Commission and now it is for the House to give its opinion on the recommendations made by the Commission. Our desire is that as soon as the Parliament, this House as well as the other House has discussed this report and expressed its views, we will go ahead with the recommendations made and we will certainly like that they are implemented as early as possible. I do not want to enter into generalities, but it must be said that our country is vast and our problems are also immense. Generally, we are a very poor country and it is true that during the British days, we did not actually realize what poverty meant. People suffered without much protest, but now when the country is trying to go ahead with economic development, it is but natural that every section of our community should like to progress simultaneously. I think if we are frank, we should admit that there are certain weaker sections of our community in the country who have not made as much advance and progress as others have done. It has therefore become very important that we should lay a special emphasis on the development of the scheduled caste and the scheduled tribes. Stop.